Aircraft recreation to present all the all the all the aviation avian incident and crashes it all of aviation crashes and and incidents iceberg. So here we go. Floor one. Malay Malaysia Airlines Flight 370. Malaysian Airlines Flight 370 was was a was a scheduled passenger flight from Kuala Lumpur to to China to Ch Beijing. China, China, when when suddenly out of nowhere it went missing. The the people found twenty six. The people found twenty six wreckage pieces from the same plane. Nine Eleven. Nine Eleven was a terrorist morning. This morning, this this iceberg name has has mentions of terrorism and suicidal terrorist terrorism. All right, so if you want, I don't know what. If you want, skip to the time in the in the thing in the in the in the screen on the bottom of the screen see so, yeah. so let's get to it nine eleven nine eleven was a suicidal ter terrorist a bombing with four planes Flight eleven, flight seventy seven, flight one seventy five, and flight in in United ninety three, the most famous one. The so, the planes crashed into two iconic towers, including and including and one crashed into the Pentagon, which the the two were crashed into the twin towers were. Flight eleven and flight one seventy five. While the while the while the plane that crashed into the Pentagon was was flight was flight seventy seven. United ninety three tried to try passengers got into the cockpit and and got control of the plane. Causing it to crash into a field 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 near near Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Malaysia Airlines Flight Seventeen. Malaysian Airlines Flight Seventeen, also known as MH Seventeen, was a was a scheduled passenger flight that flew over the which which got shot down by the Ukrainians. I mean Russians during the war. The the, the nose split off when the plane was shot. Then it went down. And then soon after, the the Russians soon realized it was a passenger plane. <laughs> Miracle on the Hudson, also known as U.S. Airways Flight fifteen forty nine, U.S. Airways Flight fifteen forty nine was a was a plane that. Had a bird strike on the on 
both of the engine on the boat on both of the engines. Well, luckily, as a miracle, it landed on the Hudson safely. No fatalities. Everyone got out safely. The captain's name was Solly, who landed the plane on the Hudson. Lion Air Flight 610. I don't really know about about that much about it, so I'll just skip it. I also don't know about 305 and 302. All right, let's move on to, let's move on to full floor two. We'll start off with my favorite. TWA Flight 800. The the plane was a the plane was a scheduled Boeing 747 scheduled from New York John F. Kennedy to 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 Rome with a stopover in Paris. But then 20 minutes after it, it took off it it exploded it exploded ripping off the ripping off the nose and and it had enough speed to go up then it then it went down causing the plane to explode making both wings and tail to break off Pan Am, Pan Am 103, Pan Am 103 was a plane that took off, I don't know where it took off, so I don't know where it was what going, but, but, a, a, but, sometime after it took off, a bomb on it exploded, ripping off the nose and then making it explode. And, and killing all the passengers on board. So the person who placed the bomb had 2,207. 70 accounts of murder connect along with the Pan Am 103. Ten, Tenerife Airport Disaster. The Tenerife Airport Disaster was a was two planes at Tenerife, also known Tenerife International which is now known as Los Rodeos. The, the plane had kale KLM forty five oh eight and 
and and Panam Panam seventeen thirty six. Sorry about the Google. Sorry about me searching up the Google. I did. I forgot what the plane was. What the Pan Am was. What Pan Am seven seventy seventy. 1763, I mean, 1376, I think, yeah, I don't even, we're just called Pan Am 1376. The ten, the, both planes collided with each other while the KLM was racing toward it without its runway clear, clearance. Then it did a tail strike, then collided with Pan Am 1736. Alright, I'm back. Alright, All right, let's continue. <laughs> Air France Flight 4590. Air France Flight 4590 was a was a super set a super jet Concorde airliner that that was in the that that engine number two exploded and burst out flames, making it one of the first Concorde crash, crashes in the entire history of aviation. Going up. 101 deaths, of oh, 111 deaths. Helios Airways Flight 522. Helios Airways Flight 522 was a scheduled passenger flight taking out from I don't know where it took, took off to I don't know where it was supposed to go, but just a single flip, a single button, a single switch just just made just just made the just made the entire plane frozen with all the passengers unconscious. But but and two F sixteens flew on it to see what was going on, and then they didn't even see a, a, the captain in the or co pilot and captain in the plane. So. But soon after, it lost all of its fuel and then crashed. Okay. Korean Airlines Flight 7. Yes, just 7. The Korean Airlines Flight Seven was a was a scheduled Boeing seven forty seven passenger flight coming from Anchorage, Alaska to I don't know where it was supposed to land. But 
but when it but when it flew over the Russian Kinlila during the Soviet Union, it got shot down by jet. And then it crashed, obviously. Pacific South PSA PSA 182 Flight 182 The the plane was or also known as Pacific Southwest Airlines Flight 182 PSA 182 was a scheduled Boeing 727 coming from I don't know to I don't know when it, when when it collided with a Cessna on the bottom, it burst out flames from the wing. Even two pictures were taken here. On. Yeah, this was the final seconds of it. Yeah, that's PSA 182 right there. And then it and then it found its final seconds. Then it crashed. Air India flight 182. The, the plane was a scheduled Boeing 747 going from I don't know to I don't know to the plane. But then a bomb exploded, just like Pan Am 103. But it but this time it was worse. So the plane exploded into pieces when the bomb exploded. There's a, there's three hundred, there's three hundred and twenty nine fatalities. American Airlines flight American Airlines flight 182 American Airlines flight 18 I mean American Airlines flight not 191 That's what happens when you get hiccups American Airlines flight 191 was a scheduled DC10 Coming from I don't know to I don't know. The plane, but then the plane lost its lost engine number three three on the when it was when it took off and then it cr and then it crashed. So we took. The fatalities were two hundred and seventy three two hundred and seventy three. Even some guy didn't caught it. Even yeah yeah, guy caught the final seconds of it. And then and then it crashed. Japan Air Japan Airlines flight 123 Japan Airlines flight 123 was was a scheduled Boeing 747 to go to
was that was going from Tokyo to to Osaka. But twelve minutes after it took off, its tail broke off, and and it. But what keep the pilot sit, kept the plane floating, kept the plane in the air for thirty two minutes until it made its wings, its first impact with the wing on Mount. Osaka, and then making making its final impact on the on on the on the plane, which was Mount Takamakahara. Asiana Airlines, Asiana Flight 214. Asiana 214, if you were born before 2020, 2013, you probably already know about this one. So skip to the time ahead. The Asiana Flight 214, the plane was a Boeing 777 that was that was landing at SFO, but accidentally kept its wing too low, and its tail too low. The plane, then the plane, its wing broke off when it hit the when it hit the barrier. Then it spun spun around off the runway. Only three people died. Many injured. But two initially. Alaska Airlines Flight 260, 261. The plane was... I don't know what the plane was. But it... But I don't know what where it took off or was... Departing. But soon after takeoff, it, it it flipped upside down and then crashed. That's all I know. Stage three. Stage three. The Air France flight forty forty four seven. Plane was the plane was a Air France plane. That, don't know the aircraft type, but soon after takeoff, it. Speedometer failed and then went down, causing it to causing it to crash with two hundred and twenty eight fatalities. Swiss Air, Swiss Air Flight One One One. The plane was a BC-10 that was scheduled to fly from, to fly from John F. Kennedy to, I don't know. Yeah. But then, the top of the plank caught on fire and then it crashed.
Air China Flight 611. The plane was a the plane was a boat 747 that was scheduled to fly from I don't know. To I don't know. The plane was a, a plane, but decades before it, it did a tail strike, then it exploded, causing it to rip it. The tail broke off, and then the rest of the plane broke off, including the cockpit and things. Air New Zealand Flight 901, also known as the Mount Air also known as the Mount Erebus Disaster. Nine, the, the plane was a, the plane was going from, I don't know, to like, I don't know. But, but soon after it went into Antarctica, and then it, 19, in 1979, then it crashed into Mount Erebus. That's all I know. Air, Air Florida Flight 90. The plane, Air Florida Flight, Air Florida Flight 90 was a scheduled passenger flight from from one I don't know to like to I don't know, but soon after, but 31 seconds, yes, 31 seconds after it. Took, took off it it lost power and then it and then it smacked smashed its tail into the bridge and into a bridge and then crashed into an ice lake. American Airlines flight five eighty seven the plane was uh Airbus A three hundred. That was that was I don't know where it took off and departed. Or where it took off or was going to. But soon after it took off it the tail ripped off, causing it to do a dive. And then it crashed. Four, four, five. I mean, four. Yeah, four, five. U.S. Oh, so that was a plane. Right now, I remember the plane. U.S. Bangalore Airlines Flight Two Eleven was a scheduled passenger flight, which was to farm. Oh, uh, let me see. A bombarded Q four hundred that crashed into into Nepal. Even some 